Hello everyone, welcome to the video. My name is Koslix. Today, I'm going to prove to you guys how I made Brawlhalla change five times. I forced them to change, okay? Um, most of these I definitely had an immediate impact on, so this is not clickbait. I could have clickbaited and said like 10 times, but there's a lot of tournaments where I wasn't just the only one who was placing really well. For example, Winter Champs 2020, Stingray won, I got fourth, Lance gets nerfed. Yeah, I'm not including that. So everything, I have a bunch of tabs open. It's basically proof and then the nerf. And we're going to go from uh, in chronological order from 2017. And uh, yeah, so this first tournament, this is one of the first tournaments I played in. Um, back in 2017, this is my first time like being diamond in a full season. I went from 2150 to about 2600. And I did that by not only spamming one move, but I essentially just abused a gimmick. Um, Scarlet Lance Downsig had zero recovery frames, essentially. Um, so if you actually so take a look at this, his, um, I don't know if you see in this gameplay, there's a Kozilix Downsig's counter. Do you see this? It's at 14, okay? And I, I couldn't find the original broadcast. It's no longer up. up. This is like a highlights or something. It has one view. Crazy. Um, but there's literally, I was downsigging so much that they have a counter. Do you see this neutral downsig, downsig? It had zero recovery frames. So Bob literally like the, Bob Henderson, 91. That's who I was playing against at the time. Literally could not punish it. So I, I downsig and it creates tempo. If you don't know what tempo is, it's when I'm using an attack or anyone's using an attack where you're intentionally missing the attack to make your opponent think that they can punish it, but they can't. And here, Bob can't punish it, and so I just spammed it and kept spamming it. Um, as you can see right there, zero recovery frames. You see how fast that downsig is. Look at that. Boom. I'm already moving while the clouds are still out. I was moving. Look at this just one more time. Look how fast this is. Boom, and I'm moving. It, it, was, it was a glitch, and I abused it to get to 2600. Let's go. Um, so this was the first time, and... Uh, it th wasn't in the patch notes back then. I went all the way back. I actually could not find it, which is weird. Um, but they, I, I made Brahala balance this. This is about summer 2017, just early summer. I believe it was the Artemis patch. If I'm wrong, someone in the comments correct me. Um, but it was just around this time when they nerfed it. And uh, yeah, I couldn't find the patch notes for it, but I they, they nerfed it. And they actually went too far. They made it like feel really bad. And then they buffed it a little while after that, but I'm not including those. Um, so yeah, that was the first time. And then this is later in that year. This was the U.S. East Regional Qualifier. Um, essentially when Dash got added to Brahalla, this is now September 2017, um, they made Sidelight Sare consistent. And Sidelight Sare, as you know, is a one dodge frame string today. It was a true combo that was consistent. So I just want to show you some of the gameplay. Um, essentially my game plan back then was sidelight side air to get advantage state and then just win neutral and keep sidelight side airing so here's like me against starlight and back then starlight was like a top three top five player um you can kind of just see i'm just holding stage control i don't even care if my opponent comes back because i'm just gonna sidelight side air baby and then yeah you, you can just kind of see it um then i use some sarah with tempo sidelight side air again it was so consistent um that it was pretty broken and don't get me wrong, Remy also, Remy's the one who won this tournament. Um, he played Roland, actually, but he wasn't abusing the sidelight cider, not even close to what I was doing. He was using, like, completely different combos. He was just diffing everyone because he was just better than everyone back then. Um, so, like, you could say that, uh, like, Remy and some of the other players who are also on Lance pushed for the change, but I was the one who really, I got third this tournament, and this is my first top eight online, first ever top three. And uh, yeah, it was pretty broken. So here's the ba the balance changes. Um, Rocket Lance Sidelight. This is about, I think, October, um, just before, like a month before BCX. Um, Rocket Lance Sidelight decreased stun from 18 to 13. Five frames they removed from Sidelight. That's crazy. Um, they changed the force. Um, I think they gave it variable force. Yeah, do you see it says zero variable right here? Now it shows 20 variable. Essentially, this made Sidelight a kill option for BCX. If you watch BCX, it wasn't actually a kill option, but it killed it like 220 health. It was really bad. Sidelight was the worst combo starter in the game after this. This is an awful change that they reverted pretty quickly after, but it made BCX 2017 really difficult for Lance players. Um, 
slightly increased speed bonus from dash increased recovery time on miss they decrease damage the damage and all that doesn't really matter it's mostly the variable force and the stun that were big changes um and i definitely played a, a major part in this uh shout out to europe who also played lance but uh i'd like to claim the side light sarah nerf um if you argue in the comments then um go ahead um this is this is open discussion i appreciate your feedback um, there's a lot of other situations and uh, balance stuff I'm not like adding to this, so it's like I, I could have I could have went more than five um, with an argument. Okay, so next tournament. This is not even a year later. This is like I don't know, like five months later. Uh, this was May 30th, like very end of May, early June. I won DreamHack Austin. The changes they made from now from that last patch, they fixed Sidelight. They made Sidelight recovery a true option, so they actually just switched it to a different combo and then so i kind of did the same thing and used side that recovery i didn't absolutely abuse other recovery it kills not as fast as sarah um but you can kind of see like i won dreamhack austin on side that recovery this is the most cringe pop-off not this not this that was a good pop-off don't look at winners finals dreamhack austin 2018 pop-off i'm so sorry yeah that's me i won a tournament wow i'm flexing it there there i am hi foda hi boomy young boomy young wrench d um, yeah, the good old days of Brawlhalla. Anyways, um, so yeah, after after this, they uh, they added this startup frame to recovery and made it one dodge frame. Um, I was the only one really playing Lance at this time. Correct me if I'm wrong. So, I claim ownership. Um, by the way, I went from winning DreamHack Austin to placing 33rd at Summer Champs. So, uh, anything is possible if you're top 128. Dream big. Uh, I was also trash. I think I got like 33rd at like Spring Champs. I, I was really low seated at Austin. And then I just kind of upset the seed one, took his seed. So yeah, um, this I claim ownership. I won a tournament and then they removed the combo. Next time. Um, so a little bit later, 2019, um, they didn't really touch Lance after that patch really. Um, it was pretty balanced and mid for a while. And then September, they added Sidelight Recovery back. I got ninth at BCX. I honestly could have played better. Um, and then going into 2020, uh, I had Sidelight Recovery as a true combo. Nair was crazy good. And then I placed really well. They nerfed Lance, but Stingray also placed well. So Stingray hopped off Lance. I stuck to it. And spring, uh, summer champs, I got second. And so you can kind of see me beating Boomy here. Um, and you can kind of just see, I really use side of the recovery. Same like with Austin. Boom, right? Uh, same idea. Um, it was essentially a battle between should Lance have true combo con confirms or should it not have it? And this might go on in the future. They might add them back. You never say never. Um, so one patch without, one patch with, one patch without, one patch with. Anyways, side of the recovery was true. So guess what they did right after this tournament that I got second in? They nerfed side light recovery again. Um, recovery, increased minimum charge. Thanks, Brahala. Yeah, that's great. Um, so side light recovery is no longer a true uh, combo. Wesley was also placing pretty well. Um, just huge shout out to Wesley. I'm goaded Lance player. The only reason why I'm claiming this balance change is because at the time, Brazil wasn't seen like it is today. Um, Fiend was kind of like really good in 2019 but he wasn't good enough to like make a mark at lands like he went to ceo and the bcx's and whatnot and didn't perform like you'd see brazilians perform today so the point i'm trying to make is i feel this is a personal opinion uh again comment down below if you disagree that's totally fine if wesley won a tournament but no one in na was like winning tournaments on Lance or being even like top three, top six, I don't think they would have changed it. But me being at the top and Wesley being at the top, um, they changed it. If I was at the top alone, I think they probably still would have changed it because considering in the past, they changed it last time at DreamHack Austin and whatnot. So yeah. Um, and then they also nerfed Lance and Winter Champs. It's kind of weird to still see it at the top. Um, so yeah, they nerfed it again. And uh, guess what? I was still at the top. I placed third at LTC. I got second at Steel Series, and I got second at Autumn Champs all 2020. If 2020 was on LAN, I probably would have won a LAN. Um, I was that good at Brahalla in 2020. Um, maybe it's my ego talking, but I got proof. Uh, I got second in basically every single tournament in 2020 until they gutted Lance. Um, so here's like another tournament. Um, essentially, so first I started with like, um, in Winter Champs, there were like Nair combos are pretty broken. Um, then saw the recovery. Now, 
what option do I have? Well, my Nair is pretty broken. So I just want to show you some of this gameplay when I pick up a Lance here. Look how many Nairs I use in neutral because there's a pure tempo option. It was broken, right? And I don't disagree with nerfing Nair. Um, but take a look at this. We got like, get ready, one hit. Okay, not too much. Two, three. Uh, okay, losing some neutral, All right? It'll end light tempo, Sarah tempo, works for, it's a combo, so it's not that crazy. Five, see it's unpunishable. There's it again, All right? Tempo, tempo, there's it again, there's it again, there's it again. Do you see how many nares? It's just a little too much. And I think like TWK, Brahala balance team, whatever, they knew it. Um, you'll see some more um, little instinct tempo. I used so much tempo back then. Do you see this? It's actually absurd. I need to do this more again. Um, I guess it's more punishable today. But like back then, I would just like spam when I knew my opponent couldn't do anything, and it really worked. Maybe I do it again. But yeah, you can just see me. I I, I felt like sandstorm at times. Nair, um, me being safe here. Yeah. Uh, anyways, I I spam there. So what did they do to Nair? Um, take a look at this. This is a big change. And then I got like ninth at BCX and ninth at Mammoth Cup. I'm an idiot. We're gonna cut that out of the video. I made a mistake. An oopsie doopsie. Um, Rocket Lance Neutral Air. So they updated the hitboxes to be way smaller because they were pretty big, had some nice priority. Um, but they increased outward threat cover. Okay, that wasn't a buff. That, whatever. They decreased the acceleration and maximum speed allowed during the hit. Um, and recovery time on this. This essentially removed all your momentum after you nared, so you'd get like stuck in place. And like again, Wesley was also really good at Lance back then. Shout out to him. But after placing third, second, second, I'm claiming this victory. Uh, if I didn't do that, they probably wouldn't have changed this. Um, at least this in particular, I was pretty much spamming. So yeah, uh, they basically made Nair incredibly slow. Um, you could argue I forced Brahala to change a lot more from not performing, um, being the best at Lance at the time, them saying, oh, Koslix is doing bad, let's buff Lance. Um, they do that for a lot of weapons, to be fair, with a lot of pro players sometimes, um, if it's like Blasters or Boomy or whatever. But uh, it's pretty crazy. I definitely forced Brahala to change at least five times. Um, so, yeah, that's pretty cool. If you enjoyed this, like, subscribe, comment, let me know your thoughts down below. Thanks for watching. Hopefully I entertained you and made your day just a little bit better. Thanks. See you guys.